My name is Gilbert Masolia, working for Comax Manufacturing Limited in Rueru. Comax Manufacturing Limited is located in Rueru town, just near Plainsview Hospital, behind Ruby's petrol station. We normally deal in the production of eco slabs. The eco slabs are being used in the shuttering. That is, I mean, when you want to do shutters for, 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 your, for your building, instead of using the normal casting, you use the ribs made or casted from our factory. And also the hollow blocks, the same way being made in our factory. Mainly we use uh, high quality cement. Like uh, when we do produce the the beams, we use bamboo cement, which is PowerMax 42.5. And when it comes to the production of the hollow blocks, we use Simba cement, that is 32.5. We also have the steel tendons, five millimeters thick. When it comes to the production, we have a machine that's being used. Now, this is the production place. This is the area where the steel tendons are being used to make the, the beams. Now, our beams are normally 50 millimeters by 150 millimeters uh, 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 wide. We normally customize. That is, we come to the site, we get the measurements or the span of each and every room, after which we'll have to get the measurements and then uh, come to the factory to get those measurements because the whole length cannot be able to be used in a particular, in a particular room that has not been uh, uh, measured actually. And even if you cut six meters of the beam, there is no sagging. It's quite straight. The curing for these beams is normally 14 days. Less than 14 days, it's better for the customer to wait for some time. However, urgent, he, he may need, he just have to wait for the 14 days to lapse, and then we'll give something that is well cured. If a customer wants transport services, we also provide. We have our vehicles that assist, but at a cost. These ones already have been cut, waiting for the customer to, to carry or be de delivered to the customer. And that's why I said that uh, we, uh, we do what, what is known as customizing. We go to the site, we get the measurements for every room, the kitchen, the sitting room, the bedroom, and every other room that is there. And that's why you are seeing these beams in different sizes. This one might be for, for the balcony. This one might be for the, uh, for the toilet. This one might be for the, for the sitting room. Uh, uh, this one might be for the, for, the, for, the, for the bedroom. ETC, ETC, ETC. In the manufacture of the blocks, we use cement, the 2.5. We use ballast. We use uh, sun, pumice, and also water. Our machine is complete with uh, several chambers used in the manufacture. For, ex for example, we have the mixer, we have the belt that tra uh, transports the materials after mixing, and to the machine itself, that compresses the blocks. The blocks are compressed in a way that there is none that can be, uh, uh, be found to be uh, of less value. That is uh, one that has uh, broken or that one that has got teared out. In terms of individual pricing, the hollow block 120 by 200 by 400, we sell at 85 shillings per piece. 
the beam we sell at 5.45 shillings per meter. So it will depend on the quantities that will, that will be required by the client. Today we're in a school in uh, Kenyatta Road. We are doing a uh, two-story and uh, we're using the flat beam and the auto blocks. This project, mm -hmm. you are the ones that have supplied the entire beam and blocks for this project. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, we are the ones who have supplied the entire block. Uh, and we are doing two floors because it's a school. A, a common question I get on the channel is how many floors can you do with the beam and block You technology? can do as many as you can because the leaves on these blocks, they are all right. And uh, when you're using all, it reduces the, the weight of the slab. So uh, as long as it is designed to, to go like six floors, you can even do so. But it depends with the plans also. Because okay. you have to look at the plans when we are supplying to you first. Yeah. So that we can be able to give you a quote. You have a project that is uh, above four floors? Yes, yes. We are doing one in Kasalani. Yeah, we're going for six floors. We're in fourth floor right now. Oh, okay. Yes, yes. And you will do the entire floors with the flat yeah, beams? Yeah, we have started from the first floor to, to the sixth floor. Okay. Yes. Now, for this project, mm -hmm. I see that the beams are quite special. Mm -hmm. Sorry, the blocks, they are mm -hmm. quite special. Mm -hmm. uh, why is there a difference b between uh, the blocks you have supplied for this school mm -hmm. and for other projects? Uh, the reason is this is a school, eh? it has high traffic people, eh? because you cannot limit the, the number of people who are on top of the floor. Eh? So that's why you're using uh, the nine inch block. The difference is the other one is six inch, this one is nine inch. Okay. So it's, it's a way, it's, example, it's a mall, it's a school, it's a church, we normally use the nine inches blocks. In terms of pricing mm -hmm. per square meter, mm -hmm. how much do you charge for, for, for flat beam? For right? flat beam and blocks, we, we normally charge at, uh, it depends with the, if you, you don't want us to supply, you have your, example, you have your own trucks. Eh? We can uh, do at 1900 per square meter for the five inch. For this one, we do at 2500 per square meter for the bigger block for nine inch. Okay. Yes. Uh, what we normally do, we first use your architectural drawing to give you an estimate code. Then after doing that, we normally visit the site. We have technicians who come to the site. Uh, they come take the measurement each room. So we customize beams from, uh, according to the sizes of the rooms. Like this one, we have customized according to the classes. <laughs> These classes, eh? There are different classes, uh, sizes, so you customize it with three meters, you customize three meters. Okay. So there's no customization on site. Yeah. It's just three in the beams and blocks, so it is very effective. Yeah. yeah. So that also mi minimizes theft of yes, the beams? Yes, yes, yes. There's no theft for that because now we blend a complete set of these blocks and beams. We are actual. Yes, we only uh, use the shortest span because of the strength. So the when you're doing the form work, eh, the, form, the longer side is where we do the props and the three two timber to support our beams but the shorter uh, side is where we we lay the beams and but also it depends there eh, with uh, other structural we look at uh, there's some things we look at eh, like this room we have, as you can see eh, there's some rooms which have, we have alternated this beam you can see this side they have gone on the longer side the other mm -hmm. one is because of the shorter side because it's our all eh? yeah so we need to balance the weight when we're doing the beams and blocks, so that we make sure that one beam does not ca carry a lot of weight than the other. Okay. So we have a structural engineer who advises us on how to do those. So we give all that inclusive of our cost. Okay. Yeah. Do you know the size in square meters of this uh, slab? Yes, this slab is uh, it's a, it's a 870 square meter. Oh, so it's yes. a massive, eh? It's a massive, yeah. It's a school, it's 870 square meter. And how long has your team uh, put the beams and blocks? Uh, this uh, yeah. two days. Two days. This is the second. We started on Monday, today, uh, Tuesday, and today we are finishing up. Okay. Yes. So it's normally like a three-day job for yeah, this two to game. three days because of deliveries and because we delivered on Monday, they started yesterday and today. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So that's quite fast for 870 yes, square meters. Yes. Yes. Yeah. We're not doing flat beam. It's a bit faster. Okay. Yeah. So that means like for smaller sizes, you can yes, like can uh, do in one day. like a mansion, it, if it's less than uh, 500 square meter, you do it within a day. Plus oh. it depends with the casual labelers that you have on site. Eh? Yeah. If the casual labelers on site are many, the faster we do. Because here we have like 20 guys. Okay, this is uh, Kaburima and Toribi. As you can observe uh, in the background, uh, my team is uh, installing uh, beams and those blocks. Okay. These are our three phase blocks. Uh, currently, we are doing the uh, installation, the, the final, the final touches. After which, uh, after installation of the beams, we shall uh, 
lay the conduits before we do the casting on site. Okay. Yeah. And what's the spacing between beam and beam? Okay, beam to beam spacing is 400, uh, 400 millimeters. Okay. Yes. After this, when are you going to cast the slab now? Okay, once the guys have laid the conduits, as you can observe around, yeah. uh, the conduits are getting laid. Uh, after that, uh, we shall uh, spread our BRC. Most probably, two days from now, we shall be casting, depending on the speed of the guys that are doing the conduiting. Thank you.